I understand today's focus is really on learning how to overcome the child, the adult, to learn faster and easier. I wonder if there's any uh, benefit uh, in this training with regard to the emotional regulation. Um, you know something, we don't target emotion and behavior, but when you have a child that can perform a whole lot easier than he did before, when he can finish his homework in 15, 20 minutes instead of two, three hours, uh, you get a child that starts thinking about himself differently and he behaves differently. So that's not our target, that's sort of a side benefit of what we do. All right? You see, I would rather change his skill and make easier learning and faster and better for him than to say, you are a bright child, you're a bright child, and get him emotionally feel a whole lot better about himself, but his performance doesn't improve because later on he won't think so good about himself anyway because he's strict. Also, our training is intense, but it is also fun. So you went a little tough on how tough it is. Um, <laughs> Because what we do is we do work like right underneath their frustration level, but the whole time we're working on what they can't do, and, but we're turning that can't into a can. And it's fun little games kind of like this, and so kids actually enjoy it. Um, you know, the first time they do it, it's very different than anything they've done before, but they really start to enjoy it. Um, and they have their own personal coach that's kind of a cheerleader and a coach for them. And so most kids really enjoy the training, even though it's hard. And so it is hard, but it's also fun. You consider the video games out there. People don't buy the games that you just pass and get real easy and there's no challenge. It's where you get shot down a few times and you get hit or whatever. Whatever the game is, the violence, is, I mean, you, you can die a lot of the times in some of those games, but you keep going because it's challenging. Right? And, and every time you go through another level, it's like a victory. And that's how it is with kids. They enjoy breaking new barriers. And here's a really positive thing emotionally. When a child starts breaking barriers he never thought he could break before, he starts thinking he can break other barriers he's never even come across before. So the, the whole emotional and the attitude it becomes a whole different thing. I was just going to say the number one comment that we get from parents at the end of training, because uh, we'll say, what, what did you think? The number one thing they'll say is that uh, my child's confidence has improved. They feel like they can do anything now, where before um, they didn't even want to try things. But now because of the new skills, they'll try anything. So they, it's, a, it's a very uh, good, positive outcome for them emotionally.